Hi, welcome to my tiny kitchen. I've been bottling some wines for Christmas and I thought if you're new to wine making you might have the same problem I did when I started and you might have your hands on one of these. It's a corker. But then you'll be thinking, what do I do with it? How the hell do I use it? That's what I used to wonder. So I thought I'll do a quick video to show you how I use it and problem solved. Another tip which I think is important, is remember to soak the corks that you're going to use. And I'm going to advise to use the corks and a corker. Don't use the screw caps. If you do, there is a big, big risk when you have put your wine back in your bottle, you put the cap on, if the fermentation starts again, there's nowhere for the gas to go that's building up with all the fermentation and your bottle will explode. If you use the corks, leave the bottles on their side, at least if it starts to ferment again, all that's going to happen is the cork will fly out. And so does your wine, but it doesn't have shattered glass everywhere. That's happened to me once. So use the cork. So get your soaked, soaked cork and you're going to put it in, and you see in here, you're going to put it in here like that. Okay? Then this part here, you're going to place over your bottle. And you're going to bring your handles down so your two sides grab the bottle, like that. And then really, when you see this plunger coming down, try and make sure that your cork is in the middle. You can rearrange it slightly. Straighten that up, that's it. So it's going to hit in the middle of your cork. And then it's going to be quite firm, but I wouldn't go too fast. I've heard people pulling strings and all sorts when they do this. I'm just going to move that jug out of the way in case it was a disaster. Oh, I didn't say it was easy. There. One done. Eleven to go. Here bubbles in the background, that's the wine I put into a damage on last night. Oh, that was easier. Ah. ah. Leave the corks to soak for a bit longer. See? In. Right. Next. In. Straighten that out. There you go. So I hope that helps. Have fun with your corker.